Hey guys, what is going on? Hope you're having a fantastic day. Welcome to another top budget players of Madden 18. Right now we're going on to budget center, so <clears throat> we're gonna look at three uh, three categories: run blocking, pass blocking, and overall. So yeah, let's jump right into it. So we have Tyler Larson starting off with the gold. He's got gold gold run blocking, of course. So he's got 4,000 coins, 86 strength, 73 run blocking, 74 pass blocking, 74 impact blocking. But I really thought the 83, 86 strength was really the most important thing. And he also has 80 run blocking strength, so that is why I chose him. Next, we have the Bengals center, Russell Bodine, 76 overall for 3,000 coins. He's got 90 strength, which is really big, and a 69 pass blocking, 72 run blocking, 75 impact blocking. But really, I think that 90 strength is a really good threshold. And he also has 81 blue run blocking strength, so those two combinations are really good for run blocking. And if you're just needing to run the ball, I think he's perfect. Starting off with Elise, 84 overalls did jump a little bit because of the auction house, but right now we have uh, JC Trader, 84 overall, 23,000 coins, got 83 strength, 81 run blocking, 82 pass blocking, 82 impact blocking, 82 awareness, so he's not only going to be able to run the ball for you, run block for you, but he also will pass block and everything, but he does have 83 run blocking strength, so that is why I chose him, and he's one really good choice. Next we have this Jason Kelsey, 83 overall, 29,000 coins. He was cheaper on Mudhead, but of course he's 29,000 coins. But 84 strength, 80 run blocking, 86 impact blocking, 80 awareness. He also has 83 run blocking strength, so he's a good budget beast. Normally he was cheaper, but he jumped up in price. But with Team of the Week peaks, Team of the Week packs coming out now, he should jump down in lower price. So you are going to pay a little bit more because they are offensive linemen once again. But I'll link down below on how to make coins, and that's really it. And he is he is rounding off our elite budget right uh, elite budget centers. Starting off pass blocking, we have Ryan Khalil, 81, 81 uh, run blocking strength, 79 overall, 3,800 coins. He's got 83 strength, 71 run blocking, 77 pass blocking, 82 impact blocking. Now for pass blocking, obviously, 77 pass blocking is very good and 82 impact blocking is very good. He also has 81 pass blocking strength, which is huge, so he's really going to be a good pass blocker for you. Next we have this Travis Swanson for 70, uh, 79 overall for 5,000 coins roughly. He's got 81 strength, 74 run blocking, 77 pass blocking, 78 impact blocking, and 78 awareness. He also has 80 pass blocking strength as you can see he does have a team of the week it's a little bit more pricey though so i don't know if it's worth getting that one or not but he is a good choice for a good budget gold uh, gold center who you want for pass blocking if you pass the ball a lot starting off our elite we have marquise pouncey 83 overall 16,000 coins 85 strength 77 run blocking 82 pass blocking 82 impact blocking 84 awareness so he's got 80s in all the rights categories for pass blocking he also has 85 pass blocking strength which is really high for a budget elite well, for elite that's under 20,000 coins so that's why I chose him he's all, like he's just gonna be a good pass blocker for you secondly we have Greg Mance 84 overall 19,000 coins he's got 81 strength 85 pass blocking which is a little bit higher he's got 82 impact blocking 85 awareness 78 run blocking so I don't know what awareness plays into pass blocking or anything like that but as an offensive lineman you must have to you have to have good awareness um, to be a good uh, offensive lineman of course so he also has 84 pass blocking strength, so with 84 pass blocking strength, 85 pass blocking, 81 strength, he's just going to be a beast and be able to hold down the center for you of passing. Going into our overall category, our final category, we have AQ Shipley, AQ Shipley 79 overall for 4,000 coins. He's got 81 strength, 75 run blocking, 76 pass blocking, 78 impact blocking, and 79 awareness. Now for overalls, I really just look for golds at least for anything that's like 75s in each category, so this guy fit perfectly. He also had a 81, which was good, and so this guy's a very good center, and I'd use him for a budget if I really needed him. Next we have this David Andrews, set 2,000 coins, 78 overall. He's got 80 strength, 74 pass block, round blocking, 74 pass blocking, 77 impact blocking, 80 awareness. So like I said before, looking for 75s. I mean, he was two off, one off for round blocking and pass blocking, but I think he makes up for it in his awareness and strength. And he also does have a team of the week card for 11,000 coins. So if you did want to get him, you could, but he doesn't really look like an upgrade that much. So honestly, I would stick with the gold or just because it's cheaper and it, you'll get the job done for a gold center. Our first budget overall center, we have John Sullivan Elite, 84, 84 overall, 26,000 coins, 84 strength, 82 run blocking, 82 pass blocking, 87 impact blocking, 84 awareness. This guy's a beast. Like he just looks like an all around beast and compared Compared to my center, I'm not really sure yet. So I have an 85 overall, and he's pretty much almost close to being that 84. So that guy's really good budget, I believe. So that's why I choose him. And lastly, once again, our budget elite would be JC Treader, 84 overall. He is the last final rounding off because he's only 23,000 coins. He also has 80s in every category. That's just perfect all around for overall. So he's also got, he's just a good guy, and I really would pick him if I needed another center. But that is the, that is really all the budget centers that I have for unboxing, pass blocking, and overall. So really hope you guys enjoyed, and thanks for watching. Let me know if you want to see more.